multiple problems that we do in this class. Um, and the last one, the guys, you have north, 120 degrees west. So again, we have a bearing. So Ashlyn, I'll do my north, east, south, west. North, 120 degrees, tells me to start due north. If it said south, I would start due south. But it says start due north, and then do 120 degrees west. Well, if we took this 120 degrees west, so we have due north, 120 degrees west, here's 90. 120 degrees west you know, is roughly going to be from here to here. Wouldn't you guys agree? How far is this away from here? 60 degrees. 60 degrees. Couldn't I also do south 60 degrees west? Would you guys agree that's the exact same? And usually, technically, what you'll usually see is you'll usually see this with an acute, with an acute angle. They usually don't use it as 120. Yes? With the bearing problem, do we label it the same as if we had like... You'll see them in both ways. You'll see them like this, and then you'll see a bearing of 288. Well, I mean, like, after we like, draw it or whatever, do you want us to put like, the direction? We're just practicing. Uh, I mean, the direction still remains. I mean, you still show the direction of everything. So does the number matter then? Because wouldn't that be in the negative direction? Yeah, that's why I thought it was negative. For the bearing, we're not, it's, um, not we're not talking about the negative or it's just this. So this angle is, yeah, well, it's just another thing of measuring this angle. But um, yes, from south 60 degrees west, we'd be measuring this angle. And for, but for bearings, it's a little bit, we're not going to, bearings, we're not using negative angles, negative versions, where you're basically just using the positive value. Whereas the standard form, negative and direction, is matters. Bearings, really, it's um, not so much. Don't use really the negative form. Yes? Which way is the, this is the potato? You did it both ways. Which one? Did what both ways? The potato? Oh, the line? I don't know. 